So today I'm going to talk about something that is a pretty big, heavy, scary, hairy topic. And that is talking about your life purpose. This is a huge topic and obviously I can't attack it from every angle. So I'm only going to talk about it from one very specific perspective and one perspective that is not commonly discussed. Now, before we get started, if you're new to my channel, then please make sure to click subscribe down below. Include the little bell with that because that way you'll get notifications every time I post a new video and also go to lindarainer.com and you'll be able to find out more about me there. Now, if you're someone who's thinking of making a career change or if you're thinking of starting a new business or if you're thinking of moving to a different country or doing something new and you don't really know if that's the right thing for you then I really want to help you through this a lot of people don't actually believe that we have a purpose and that we just kind of have to figure our way and do what we do and that's it but you know what I don't believe that I believe that we do each every single one of us we do have a purpose if it's not called purpose then it's called intention that intention is carried out through the careers that we pick, the lives that we lead, the lifestyle that we decide to take on, that intention plays throughout our lives. There's a lot of different angles that people talk about when they talk about your purpose, but what doesn't really get talked about is how your pain plays a role in your purpose. The answer to understanding your life purpose is through your pain. And when I say pain, I mean deep-rooted, deep-seated pain painful experiences that you've gone through in life that have left a mark on you, left open wounds. And these wounds are still sitting in your heart. Once we get through that cloud of pain and we're able to allow it to dissipate, we get clear and clear on what our purpose is. We get clear and clear on what it is that we really want to do with our lives. Pain actually guides you to your purpose. If we really want to live fulfilling and meaningful lives, and we really want to go after the careers that we love, we have to understand ourselves first. Your pain is your biggest teacher in life. For some reason, we have this weird idea that we should live life completely challenge-free, that things shouldn't be going wrong. But I'm telling you, no, that's not true. The purpose of our lives is to help others who are currently going through the pain that we've experienced in the past and have healed from. So, for example, you may have a deep-seated pain relating to your own self-confidence. Maybe you grew up in an environment where you didn't have very supportive parents. Parents who never gave you credit for the good things that you did. Parents who were always very critical and wanted more of you. So you grew up thinking with this mindset that you were never good enough and now that's resulted in a lack of self-confidence. That is what I call a deep-seated pain. So if you are someone who's led a life of very low self-esteem, low confidence, but you've been able to face that pain, learn from it, acknowledge it, understand where it came from, and you've gone to the other side and you've grown from that, part of what your purpose is, is to use that experience, use that new understanding, that growth that you've gone through to help those who are currently going through the exact same thing. Because you, being the one who lacked the self-confidence, had the low self-esteem, is the best person to be able to understand someone now who maybe is a few steps behind you, who doesn't see the light just yet. You're the best person to help them, and that is part of your purpose. This really applies for people who are entrepreneurs and really want to start their own businesses. I get a lot of people who say, you know, I, I want to start my own thing, but I just don't know what it is. And all they think about is whether the new thing that they're thinking of doing is going to make them money. Instead of looking at it from that perspective, look at it from a more deeper perspective, a more spiritual perspective, from the perspective of, Whatever it is that you choose to do as a business or a career, does that line up with your true purpose? Your purpose meaning you having healed from a pain in the past. And if you have a pain right now that you haven't healed from yet, then it's time to look at it a little bit more closely. If you're dealing with something like that, then I urge you to, when you're ready, to look at it. And to look at it from a very centered place. You're gonna get deeper and deeper and deeper into who you truly are. The reason why I say this with so much passion 
is because I've gone through this and I am still going through this. I mean, life is a journey in itself. So we all are evolving and expanding and growing, but I wanted to share this with you because it is life changing. You will look at life way differently when you can actually understand that the painful experiences that you're going through are actually guiding you to a deeper purpose that you have within you. So I'd love to hear from you if you're currently going through some sort of painful experience and you know you're wanting to overcome it and you are overcoming it and you're starting to see a purpose that's underneath that and all of that then please tell me share tell me tell me tell me and for anybody out there who you know who is going through a painful time in their lives then please share this with them maybe this will help them i really hope this video was helpful to you like I said, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also visit lindarainer.com, send in your email and I will be able to connect with you that way. Like, subscribe, share, all those things. Stay strong, stay positive, and I'll see you next week. Right, bye.